This video shows the item view form in Weiss's Agility 360. Let's take a look at it. We will go to our item view application on the Agility 360 handheld and click it open. To see an item view, I would simply scan the item that I wish to look and get deeper visibility into in our SAP Business One. That first item that I scan validates the item against the item data master in SAP. The description is shown here and the default warehouse is given, which is my bin warehouse. It shows that I have levels in stock, committed to orders, ordered as in POs, items that are on a PO that we're waiting for, and shows my available stock today. If you notice, we have many buttons at the bottom here. In certain cases, this is a standard item. I can drill into the bin location and see in that warehouse 05, the locations I have inventory stock to pull from. This is a simple bin view. If I am going to use a batch tracked item, I will start the form at the beginning again. I will scan my batched item. It will show me my stock levels in my warehouse 05. I will see how many I have committed, how many are on order, and how many are available. I can take a deeper look now that the batch button, because this is a batch tracked item, this batch button is enabled and I can click the batch and I can see in that warehouse 05 the available batches that I have and the quantity on hand. To look at a serialized item, we will clear the form out again and scan a serialized item and I will see the in stock, the committed, the ordered and the available quantity in my warehouse 05. If you notice here as well, now the serial button has been enabled and I can click on the serial button and visibly see all the serialized items for that product in my inventory in the warehouse on hand by serial number. This has been the Weiss's item view form with Agility 360.